identity that's left's like the right. So to do that, we need to get a common denominator here and simplify things. So we get cosine squared alpha plus one plus sine alpha squared over one plus sine alpha. All right, I'm just dealing with the numerator now. So this and this equal one, so we end up getting two plus two sine alpha over, you factor out a two, we get one plus sine theta. Uh, sorry about the mess, so that cancels out. So we're just left with two over cosine alpha, which is the same thing as two secant alpha. And that's it. Okay, I hope this helped you out. I appreciate you watching the video and you have yourself a great day.